Hello, my name is John Rossborough, and I'm a board member of the Kokomo Symphonic Society. We govern the Kokomo Symphony as well as the Kokomo Youth Symphony. The organization was started in 1973 by Dr. Benjamin Del Vecchio. The group consists of many facets. Let's start out with what the Kokomo Symphony is. It is strings such as the violin, the viola, the cello, and the double bass. Brass such as the trumpet, the trombone, the baritone, and the euphonium, as well as the woodwinds, which consists of the flute, the clarinet, the bassoon, and the oboe. Our organization was started in 1973 under the direction of Dr. Benjamin Del Vecchio. Our organization is the gem of Kokomo. It is the hidden treasure. The Kokomo Symphony is an exciting group of individuals, top-notch musicians that perform on a grand scale. Our first concert is consistent of the works of John Williams, the great cinematic, prolific composer of the 20th century. Hello, I'm Jose Valencia, and I'm the music director for the Kokomo Symphony Orchestra. This orchestra has been in your community for 43 years, and I am honored to, have, to be celebrating my 10th year with this group. Our first concert, is this weekend on Saturday, September 17th at 7 o'clock at Haven's Auditorium at IUK. Plenty of free parking is available and it's going to be an exciting evening. Why? Because we're presenting the music of John Williams, the cinematic master, master who wrote music for a lot of movies that you probably know, like Star Wars, Indiana Jones, and Harry Potter. And then he's written music that you, for movies that you may not know, but we hope you'd say, oh yeah, I kind of remember that, or, or that's gorgeous music, and I didn't know he wrote it. Music for Schindler's List, a movie called Far and Away. Um, so we're gonna bring a lot of different things together and have a great time at this event. We're also gonna invite you to do something crazy like dress up as your favorite Star Wars, Harry Potter, or Indiana Jones character and come in costume. We're gonna have a costume contest before, before the concert. Also before the concert, we're going to have some time with the music director, that would be me, who would be talking to you about, or sharing with you actually, about some of what we believe are John Williams' inspiration for some of his music. Like, where did he borrow um, something, something from uh, maybe Gustav Holst for Star Wars, or maybe he borrowed something from Richard Strauss for Superman. So there, there's gonna be a lot of fun and, and some interesting insights into the concert at the pre-concert talk. And then there's also going to be the pre-concert costume contest. So there's going to be a lot of different things are going to be happening. Now, um, we are, have a raffle for a Star Wars guitar as well. So all of these things are designed to make it just not a boring symphony experience where you sit in your seat passively and just clap at the right time. That's not what we're about. We're about hoping that you're going to experience and love and get get into the feeling of the of the orchestra and um, maybe learn to figure out how you can help support the efforts of the orchestra in the Kokomo community by serving on our board by serving as a volunteer by just spreading the word that we have a really very talented group of musicians here that come together and present music for um, for sharing with the community and bringing the community together. We invite you to come and experience all the great things that the Kokomo Symphony offers. Now let's talk just real briefly about our Kokomo Junior Symphony. It meets on Wednesday afternoons. To be available, you have to be in the third grade to senior high. We encourage you to be a part of it. Grow our symphony. This is what we're asking. 
For the rest of our season, we have a wide variety of things. The Star Wars concert, the John Williams concert, has a symphony of 60 musicians. That includes all of the instrument types that John, Mr. John Rossborough talked about. The strings, the winds, the brass and percussion. That's gonna be crazy. It's gonna be 60 people on stage all doing something together as a very big team. In November, we're gonna do some major symphonic works, but with only eight or nine people on stage. Yes, strings, winds, brass, and percussion, and a conductor, but we're gonna do some major works by um, Modest Mussorgsky, the pictures at, uh, pictures at an exhibition, and we're gonna do it with only that many musicians. Imagine how hard that task is going to be, but it's gonna be really cool. It's a great, great arrangement of this music a lot of small segments. So again, you're not gonna get bored, you're not gonna have to say, oh well, I need to wait to clap here. You'll have plenty of opportunity to show your appreciation or to feel like you're participating as part of, of this experience. That's our November concert. In December, we invite you to come to a string-only concert where We'll join together in songs for the holidays and you'll sing, maybe somebody will come on stage, one of you might come on stage and play sleigh bells with us. Be kind of fun. So we want to incorporate the community into the activities of the symphony. Then in the spring, early spring, we're going to bring a rock string quartet from Indianapolis called Orchestra Project Quartet and we're gonna play some Led Zeppelin covers and some music by some great American composers, John Adams and uh, Philip Glass. So that should be a really cool concert. Um, kind of a lot of unexpected type of things for string quartet. And then we finish with full symphony. Again, 60 people on stage, crazy. Our whole, our community has been asking for this type of a concert since, the, since we've done it about 12 years ago, and we're about ready to do it again. It's a cartoon madness concert. Um, Bugs Bunny and Animaniacs cartoons all used classical music to really um, emphasize how zany and crazy the activity is going on in the cartoons. And we're gonna do some of that. We're gonna actually do Rossini opera works that were really actually done underneath Bugs Bunny cartoons, and we're gonna show the cartoon and, and synchronize our music with the cartoon the way it was done in the recording studios in Hollywood when they, were, when they originally did this way back a long time ago, 50 years ago, 60 years ago. We have a lot of different things happening. We hope that you will come to our concerts. They start at seven o'clock with the intention of being family friendly so that you, you don't have to have your kids out too late at night. So, you know, I look forward to seeing you. Um, I'd like to meet you. So anytime that you come to a concert, please come up, shake my hand, I'll talk to you. If you have questions, I'll be glad to answer them. Um, look forward to seeing you, thank you. If you would like more information about our Kokomo Symphony, contact us at www.kokomosymphony.net. And our phone number is 765-236-0251. Thank you.